T11 complete visual impairment. It's a good field in this. All with major championship medals. Lane seven for China, the reigning Asian 1500 meters champion, and the reigning world 1500 meters champion, and the Paralympic 1500 meters champion, Sheng Jin for China. Lane five for Mexico, silver in the 400 meters here in London, Diana Corazza. In lane three for Poland, the new 1500 meters world champion, bronze in the four, fifth in the 200, Joanna Mazur. And in lane one for Colombia, the second consecutive 1500 meters world silver for her here, Maritza Arango Vitraga. Complete visual impairment, all needed guides. Class field for this, Chad Perris. Yeah, Will, these races are always really exciting with the vision impaired guys. You know, they've got to go wide to get around people as well with their guides. You've got to watch the guides and how they, uh, how they assist them on the way around as well. The final of the women's 800 metres. T11 and we're underway. Aranga Batrago in one with a guide, Jonathan Sanchez. Joanna Mazur in three with our guide, Michal Stavitsky. Diana Corazza in five for Mexico with a guide, Jorge Gaspar Sona. And Zheng Jin for China on the outside with a guide, Wang Zipeng. Brilliant start already by Corazza Castaneda. Now they can start moving inside. Joanna Mazur with that incredible kick right at the end. Eight bodies across the line to win the 1500 meters earlier in the week. Taking it up for Colombia, Maritza Aranga Butrago. Been winning major championship medals since the silver in the 800 meters in 2011. Behind her for China, Sheng Chen. In third for Mexico, Diana Carazza Castaneda. And at the back of the moment for Poland, Joanna Mazur, the 200 meters European champion. But doubling up well in the middle distances. Coming into the closing straight for the penultimate time. And Saranga Machago has never won a major championship medal on a global basis who leads the way. Cheng Chen in second for China. And there's the bell. It's Karatsa in third for Mexico and Mazur in fourth for Poland. Not a strong pace at the moment, but Chad, they are very tightly bunched with 350 to go. I think they're all just setting up for the final sort of 200 meters to all come around. They're going to be they're going to be coming wide on that home straight. It's going to be a really close finish, I feel. Bit of a movement coming on the outside now in the back straight from Carazza Castaneda for Mexico. Mazur, the 1500 meters world champion, crowned earlier in the week, finds herself in fourth place of the four. But the Colombian Aranga Matranga has got a lot of defending to do. The guide's so important, so paramount in this stage. Mazur in last place, now making a big move on the outside. She's done this before, she's heading out to lane four. Big move also for the Mexican Carranza. Here's the sprint, Aranga Matranga is leading, but for how long? For how long? They're attacking on all sides. It's Carranza on the inside, it's Mazur on the outside. Carranza in the lead. Mazur with that, oh my word, that's so tight, it might just be Carazza, 2.21.86, and if not Carazza, Mazur's made another incredible move to take it, I think the guides got it absolutely right, but Carazza Castaneda from Mexico has been given it, 2.21.86, Mazur the silver for Poland, she's got the set of medals this week, in the 15, the 8 and the 4, and Aranga Batraga, the long-time leader, the bronze for Colombia. As you saw them on that on that back straight, just setting all the race up. You know the guides are going to be doing the uh, doing the job in the ear of the girls, telling them where to be going in that last straight. And geez, that was very exciting. Especially uh, you see the Mexicans coming up on the inside of the track, which is very unusual. But uh, yeah, really, really good run, and they came out with the gold in the end. Now, just to let you know. First and second for the moment, and the live results have been scrubbed. 
but they've come back, it's still unofficial, they're checking the guides, but at the moment Karata Kassineda has it by 300s from Azor. Always have to be careful in the T11s, look with the naked eye, to me, as if the guides have got it right. But Aranga with Tiger leading at that stage, and then the rest, this is an incredible motion because she left herself open on the outside, fair enough, that's normal, but in trying to block off Mazur, she opened the door for Karatsa Castaneda to shoot it on the inside and get the gold. The result is now official. Yeah, you can't leave that line free on the inside there because they're going to take it every time. Uh, but as you see here, the guides are just going to take their girls and just quickly drop back and let, their, let the athletes go through first. Arriba! Karatsa Castaneda gets the gold from Mexico. Her guide, Jorge Casper Serna, judged that right. Ioana Mazur and her guide, Misa Ostavitsky, likewise. Silver for them. But Diana Karatsa. Celebration time for Mexico. Diana Carazza, the gold for Mexico, the first major championship of a running career. Mazur, the silver for Poland, and Aranga Petraga, the bronze for Colombia.